Okay. So, um, grass. And we talked about grass at the beginning, so I won't belabor the point here. Um, remember, grass is the number one soil builder in the world. Not trees, not brush, but grass. But grass has an interesting um, element. Like most biological things, it grows in a sigmoid curve. All right? Down here, this is time. All right, you can call it days if you want. Over here, is volume. You can call it inches or centimeters or whatever. <clears throat> so grass grows in a S curve. I call this section right here diaper grass. Right here is teen grass. And up here is nursing home grass. Okay? Now just to make sure we remember what we're dealing with here, we'll put the old uh, we'll put the old sun up here. Okay? The sun shining down and this plant is converting solar energy into biomass, into decomposable vegetable material. <clears throat> now if our goal is to maximize the amount of solar energy going into decomposable vegetable material, of these three time periods, diaper, teen, nursing home, where do we want the grass most of the time? Teen, teen thank you. Boy, you guys are smart. All right. <laughs> teen, exactly. Here's the big deal. Diaper grass and the nursing home grass are not very efficient at converting solar energy into biomass. Here is overgrazing, here is undergrazing. Remember what I said about environmentalism by abandonment, okay? So it's just as ecologically incorrect to overgraze as it is to undergraze, because this is just going to grow out here and turn brown, flatten, and then it's going to just send all of its carbon back up into the atmosphere through CO2. So, grazing, when we talk about the role of the herbivore in nature, the role of the herbivore in nature is to come to this plant and prune it off, prune it off to restart this fast growth metabolic period of time. That's the role of the herbivore. Just like a, vine, a, 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 a viticulturalist would prune a vineyard to stimulate you know, luxuriant growth, or an orchardist would prune uh, an orchard to stimulate verdant uh, productive growth, the herbivore is the natural pruner to restart this growth cycle. And that's why there are herbivores everywhere in the world that there is forage. The only continent that doesn't have herbivores is uh, Antarctica, okay?